Uh, there in this video, I'm gonna explain you the difference between GRDP uh, cut PR, SED, and AWK commands in Linux based terminal. So, all these commands are very useful uh, if you want to learn uh, Linux. You make sure that you learn these commands as well. So, I'm gonna explain you the differences between these uh, commands. So, GRDP is the command for printing the lines matching the given pattern. So, you can uh, specify the regular expressions and then it will find that regular expression using any syntax so let us try to use a w uh, grdp command so this is the syntax of grdp dash i can be used to ignore the case and then here you can give the pattern that you want to match say sydney and here you can do the uh, file into which you want to search that particular pattern so as you can see grdp command can be used to find the pattern and then it prints the lines matching that particular pattern the next command is cut which is used to print the selected columns from the input so here is the sample command cut which is uh, which is this switches f and d so f means uh, display only the third field from this particular file and this file uh, should be each line is uh, or each field in the line is delimited by the space so d stands for a delimiter in that particular file so it will display the third uh, field uh, on that particular file so as you can see these are the third fields in that particular file so if you do cat t1 as you can see perth is the third field because it is uh, considering cut command is uh, displaying third field and how to split the particular line is using the uh, spaces so since there are uh, two spaces over there the third line comes as this one Perth, Asmus, Sydney and so on so that's how you can use the cut command to display the only the portion of the particular uh, lines in a file so that's about cut command and then tr command is used to find and replace the text character by character so let us use the tr command now so this is sample tr command here what we are doing is we are trying to replace linux by mac os so here it will not uh, substitute using the word but using the characters it means that it will replace l by m i by a and so on in the given string so as you can see the output is like that i am mac os so notice that how learning word is transformed to this one it's because l is uh, replaced by M and so on so that's the uh, TR command which allows you to transform the text you can also convert lowercase to uppercase characters from lowercase to uppercase uh, you can uh, like uh, replace anything any character by uh, the new characters so that's about the TR command and next is SED. SED stands for stream editor which is used for filtering and transforming the text we can use these regular expressions to find the ma uh, pattern and replace it it also allows deleting the match matched lines so as you can see SED can uh, be used to find the patterns as a GRDP and it can also be used to uh, replace uh, the pattern with another uh, word or regular expression so it also uh, does what TR command does and so that's why it is a superset of these commands so here is the sample uh, SED command so here uh, what we are doing is we are searching the Linux in this particular line and replacing it with the Mac OS word so if you hit enter you can see that this is the transform text so that's how you can uh, use the SED command to uh, find and replace particular text you can give the regular expressions over here uh, in both the uh, s string to be found and then uh, the replacement we can use the regular expression in both the cases and G stands for globally which means that uh, replace all the occurrences of Linux by Mac OS and we can uh, use this S means substitute 
So this is about the stream editing uh, commands. The next is uh, AWK. Now AWK is a superset of all these uh, commands, so it is more powerful. It's more like a programming language. It allows to print the specific lines and columns. So S AWK is used in case of here the file is made up of rows and columns, or uh, uh, it's like a table, and uh, you can uh, use the commands like you can count the number of lines. You can uh, take the sum of the uh, values in particular column so you can use these functions uh, like uh, how you use the aggregate functions in SQL so AWK is more like a, a programming language you can use for loop, uh, if conditions etc and you can also uh, perform these operations that you can do with SCD like find and replace then deleting match lines etc so this is all about these uh, commands so each command has got specific uh, thing to do and some commands are like superset of the previous commands. So AWK, I'll say, is the more most powerful command in Linux-based terminal systems. If you like this video, hit like button.